Here at Tormach, we want to help you make things. So uh, let's use our drag knife to cut out some stencils and vinyl for sandblasting. Here at Tormach, our pets love coming to work just as much as we do. And today is a very special day because I will be adopting a new member into our family. To commemorate this occasion, I'm going to use our drag knife to create a stencil so that our new pup at Tormach will have his own customized bowl. So I'm going to cut the stencil on this PCNC 770 using vinyl stencil film, utilizing the 45 degree spring-loaded CNC drag knife with a 2D contour path created in Fusion 360. The workpiece was simply secured with some packaging tape and laid flat on a piece of aluminum stock. With this stencil film, it's easy to remove with an X-Acto knife. Just be careful so you do not cut yourself and be sure to save the inside parts. And then I'm actually going to probably cut some of this away to make it easier to lay on the bowl. Laying it on the bowl is the hardest part. You just need enough that the sand can't sneak in underneath there. Be careful when pulling the stencil off the adhesive so that you do not tear any of the details. Nice some ginger. This is like performing surgery with a video camera in front of you. <laughs> You can smooth over the decal using a driver's license or a credit card. You mask like your Bob Ross. It's your doggy bowl. Mask how you want it. Careful not to blast underneath the stencil. Bring the sand blaster directly above your work and lightly sand the detail. Yeah, it looks good. Okay, ready for me to take it off? Yeah. Okay, clean How's it up. Look? Oh, he loves this guy. Who's that? Hmm? <laughs> Why are you right here? You didn't like it. You need this. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Check out all of our latest videos here, and for more metalworking tips, tricks, and stories, subscribe to our YouTube channel.